Hi and welcome back to BNN. We are back on Magi Magi Chronicles. Bishop Margaret Wanjiro claims to have been roughened up the other day and she has since taken to social media. She took to social media on that same day to highlight how she was harassed and how she did not expect to be paid like this having supported this current regime, Kenya Kwanza regime to be precise. On the day where she made allegations of being harassed and part of her church being demolished, a wall to be precise, she claimed that there were armed police officers who stormed her church. Here is a video, a CCTV video showing how they stormed the church. You can see some of them are in plain clothes, others are in police uniform. After this incident, Bishop Margaret said she really needed urgent medical care, of which she rushed to the hospital and thereafter we saw photos of her on a wheelchair and an arm sling on, the, on one of her arms. The land issue here seems to be between Kenya Railways and Jesus is Alive Ministries, that of Bishop Margaret Wanjiro, and it is reported that the EACC is conducting a, a crackdown on the area and that Neno Evangelism, Yapastanganga, could be next. Yani, this ordeal imepatia bishop stress and anguish and she took to social media again to say how what was serikali watamtafuta lakini hawatampata and that her tears will not go in vain. We, the Jesus is Alive Ministries, we have never grabbed anybody's land. Apparently, we don't even accept land that has no title deed. The sanctity of a title deed document is so important that that is the document that gives you right to a property. We bought these properties many years ago and they are our properties. Along this lane called Weruga Lane, there is no a single property that belongs to railways, not even one. These properties belong to investors like ourselves, to other people. We are like about, I think, four or five investors. And to my right hand, you will find Kahawa House, not railways. So what are we dealing with here? We are dealing with land grabbers that have been supported from very high powers. Very high powers that they have become untouchable very high powers that as they are there they can tell you you are fighting government and you should stop fighting government so i want to say to our government and to his excellency our president william ruto and to our deputy president regarding ashagwa we loved you we voted for you we supported you you have rewarded us with broken legs broken arms hurting bodies from today. This Margaret Wanjiro that was beaten, my clothes lifted up, but he, by young men who are police, police security agents, they touched my thighs, me, a woman of God. I want to make a very sweet promise to you. Believe you me, you will look for me. You went for Benihini in America, for me, you will look for me and I'm not moving and I'm not going anywhere. I will be here. You have started a fight that you cannot fight. This one is in the heavenlies. We have lived with this community parking all these years. We have never fought. You are using the MD railways. I pity his family. Because as I cried yesterday and today, even his family plus yours are not exempted. My tears will pay. We are hurting. We are bleeding. But behold, Isaiah 61 anointing stands. Jehovah God healed the broken hearted. We are disappointed with the Kenya Kwanzaa government. Extremely disappointed. I was one of the founding members of UDA. I campaigned two years straight when others came to just steal what I had worked for. Yet, I let go. I've loved you, my president. 
I've loved you, my deputy president. I've loved your family. When you call, I obey, I answer. I've never disrespected or disregarded you. I've always loved you, prayed for you, and blessed you. But behold, from this day, take it from this altar, tables. And there you have it from the horse's mouth, Margaret herself condemning the acts and saying that her tears will not go in vain. What do you guys think? Do you think justice will be served on her end or it will just be another case where government wins at the end of the day? If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Catch you next time.